Uh, hello. Today we will be looking at how to make a silk screen for your board so you can send it out to be manufactured. First, you click on the button to manufacture and then click on silk screen. Here you'll see a few options. On um, top here we have layers and these are the, the silk screens that the board will have on the top or bottom layer or both if you, if you choose to, have, to choose so. Uh, under classes and subclasses, here you choose what will be printed onto the board. If you have a value set as silk, you will see it on the final board. But if you have it set as none, then the company would not be putting that uh, display onto the board. Um, you can choose any, and it will first choose the silk screen if possible. If not, it will choose the assembly class uh, to, to put the silk screen onto. Um, here for rotation, we have the allotted uh, angles at which the text can be rotated to fit the board so that it does not get cut off by any uh, traces. And the other important one, maximum displacement, this is just how far from the original spot any trace or any uh, text can be placed. Ideally this does not need to be touched but if you see uh, any issue definitely go and modify that. Otherwise everything else can be left pretty much the same and then from here you just hit silk screen and then what you will see is something like this which has just all the components and has uh, the names some of them are going to be upside down, some of them will be to the right just because that's how the rotations worked to make it fit so that you can see these as best as possible when you are soldering the components. Thank you.